Hey everybody, we're going to try and knock out a few more bags today, so we're on to bags five. There are only four of these again. Hopefully that won't take quite as long. Um, there, in this box, at the beginning I put kind of in the boxes sequentially the numbers because they weren't in there that way. And so I don't think we're going to finish it because this had boxes four through seven, so there are four sets instead of just the the one, two, and three that we had in the last box. So I think this might take a little longer, but we'll maybe we'll try and knock out bags five and six. Here we go. Okay, the bag fives are done. That was 48 minutes and it built the outside of the rear section including the engine engines on to bags six. Okay, I forgot to mention that bag five went a little bit quicker last time because these side pieces right here, that was a complete symmetrical build. So it could build two of them at the same time. And even the back piece was a mirror image, so a lot of it was very similar. Looks like we're dealing with four bag sixes again. And it actually doesn't look like we have as many small pieces as we have, so this one may even go a little faster. We'll see how long it takes. So much for no small bags. There were, of course, two bags of little tiny pieces in the bigger bags. So this ended up taking 58 minutes for bag six. Still pretty much on par for the course. And we will move on to bag seven. Um, I will note, these. Th so this bag six built the front pieces right here. Actually, quite a pain to attach right here into these gray pieces and these red pieces it's got four of the the pins that snap in and it's always hard to get four of them to line up especially when the weight of this one's dragging it down I found it easier to actually connect this piece right here onto the white brackets back here before snapping those on because then it kind of held it in place anyways we'll see you next time